Guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use any Android phone or any iPhone as your PC or desktop camera on any application. All right. Now, the method I'm going to show you in this video is completely wireless. You don't need a wire. You don't need to plug your phone to any of the laptop or desktop for you to use your phone camera, whether your front camera or your back camera, as a webcam in case if your laptop or your desktop camera is not that sharp and um, you want to check if the reason why the application is not functioning well is because of camera before you go and purchase any logitech or most of these expensive camera you can as well first of all use your phone camera your front camera or your back camera whether your iphone or your android or any kind of phone and you can use it to check if the actual problem that is making the application not function well is the camera before purchasing any um, webcam. So let's dive right in. First of all, for you to use any phone, iPhone or Android phone on your system as a camera, the very first thing you need to do is come to this website, okay? I'm going to put a link to this website um, in the description below this video. Come to any browser, type as a soft, all right, type azersoft.com slash vcam, ivcam. All right, click on enter. The link, you will find the link in the description below this video for those of you that um, would like to access this website. Now, once you get here, I think I have to close this. So once you get here, all you need to do is, you can see, download Windows client software. This is actually what you want to do. Is that if you're using a Windows laptop or desktop, you have to click on download Windows version, which is what I'm using. If you're using um, Apple, okay, Mac, download app in your Apple store on your phone, all right? Then download the APK file in case if this is not working for you, this is APK file for Android or if you want to link it to your website or whatever, all right? So, you can get it also in Google Play Store, right? So what you need to do is click on download. I've already downloaded this file. So I'm not going to go again and download it. Let me just open any folder, download. If you go to download, you can see this is um, the file I downloaded from that website that I just showed you now. So what you need to do is just double click and just run the installation, yes. Allow next, okay. English, select your language, whether you're French or whatever, select it. Once you open here, it will give you a list of languages. Now click OK and accept and agree. And next, next, next. Then create a desktop shortcut if you want to create a desktop. Install microphone. Um, if you want to install microphone, fine, but I'm going to uncheck this. Install. VCAM X preview. I'm also going to um, run on startup. No, I don't want it to run on startup. Just um, create a shortcut and next. Depending on what you want the software to be, you can go on and do all that. So click on install. Okay, it takes basically a few uh, minutes for this to install in your laptop. And then once the installation is done, I'm going to finish the installation and open the application, open the software anyway, and open the software. So you can see, run yes, run, finish, and all right, allow access, yes, allow access. If you want to connect to the OK, click OK. All right. You can maximize this, you can still leave it the same way it is. And what you need to do is use your phone. You have to download this on your phone as well. Use your phone and scan this uh, barcode. All right, which is the next thing we're going to do now. And here is my Android phone, my Infinix uh, Note 8. That is what I'm going to use. I'm using my S21 Ultra to record this video. So what you need to do is go to Play Store. And once you get to Play Store, click on search and type IV Cam Webcam. IV Cam Webcam, please. 
Click on it. You can see the first one is not even IV cam webcam. The second one is IV cam webcam. Click on install. And let's give it some time for this application to install. It doesn't really take time to install. Once your internet is very fast, you can see it has already finished downloading. It has already installed. All right, click on open. Allow. Allow. All right. Now you can see. Before you do this, you can see that this phone is automatically connected to my, this um, uh, phone has already connected to my laptop, even without me scanning the barcode. The reason is because, make sure if you're doing this, that you have to be on the same Wi-Fi network. Don't hotspot your internet to your um, laptop. Make sure the laptop and the phone, they are all on the same wireless network please don't hotspot or uh, use your phone hotspot to connect to your um, laptop it's not going to work you have to make sure that your phone and your laptop are connected on a wi-fi you know the wireless um, device or maybe router or anything okay and make sure your internet is actually fast you guys can see this is my back camera let me see if i will turn okay you can see that is my system right that is my hand the movement is quite very fast so this is the phone that i'm using to communicate with you guys so you can actually come over to this phone and switch you guys can see that i have switched my um camera okay so even the speed once your internet speed is very very okay the speed between this and this is also flowing so it's a very good one in case if you want to connect your um phone camera front or back camera to any application now um i don't know the application i'm going to connect to check if this is um okay let me open obs the only problem is that i'm using obs to record this thing that i'm doing and um, before i have to go back to obs and go to setting on obs and uncheck this hide obs window from screen capture so that you guys can see it all right now let me just try and um, add let me just try and add video capture. Let me see if I will see this V um, cam. All right. No. no. No, 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 no. What I clicked, I clicked on display capture. I'm not meant to click on display capture. What I'm meant to click on is video capture. Yes, video capture device. Okay. This is my laptop um camera that's the hp wide camera okay click here okay money cam okay you can see is a soft v cam click on it you guys can see that this is moving even oh this is lovely you guys can see if i change switch camera to the um let me switch to my back camera you can see this OBS is now showing my phone camera. Everything I'm doing in my phone is being captured via OBS. So you can do this on Skype, you can do this on DeepFace, you can do this on, on um, Zoom, you can do this, you can do this virtually anywhere. You can add this to any application on your system and it's going to work because it's now showing, you can even add it on Manicam, you can add it anywhere you want. So this is an amazing application. It's quite very easy for you to install it. And um, you can use it to test your camera for those of you that want to buy your camera before going to protest to be sure that what is actually making the application not to work well or making it not to display whatever you're showing very well is the camera, okay? So that is what I want to share with you guys on this video, right? So if this video was helpful, please don't forget 
to give it a thumbs up. And if you're watching my video for the first time, my name is Asuke Nakinsley, and on this channel, I give you tips and solutions on how to make money online and other relevant tips that helps in our daily online space. But during the weekend, I make sure I give you updates on new games and app in the virtual reality space. So if you wouldn't want to miss any of my videos, make sure you hit the subscription button and make sure you turn on the notification button so that you'll be the first to know once I upload a new video. I will see you guys in my next video. You guys should stay creative and remain blessed.